Hello, welcome back. Happy Saturday. <clears throat> I hope all of those of you who are in the UK still have their houses, their garden furniture and whatnot. The weather has been horrendous. Motion detected. And typically, as soon as I start streaming, someone comes to the front door. And with that, Elite Dangerous just crashed. Greetings, Mads. Greetings, Phaser Ruddock. Look at that. I love that. Just that. Whap. As soon as I say, right, we're going to stream, all holy hell breaks loose. Um, as, as, as normal. So we're going to reboot up that game. Despin to down the garden. Yeah, it was rough here in, in South Wales yesterday. We kind of had the brunt of it. Sort of like the Cardiff Barry area. Still quite windy now. Alexander, you're saying it's 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 bad in Poland, it's battering you. So you're getting what we had yesterday then. I see. That's heavy stuff. Fortunately for us, our lights flickered. Um and, and that was kind of about it, really. Uh we were quite lucky. We're quite lucky. Um, okay, here we go. We're going to go with that. And we're going to say... And why all of a sudden is this not working? Oh my God. Oh my God. I know, I know. It, it's, it, it's, it's heavy stuff. So when Elite Dangerous decides to let me back in, which would be absolutely fantastic if it does. Um, there you go. We're back. I'm going to switch into my... Let's see. Corvette. Get the Corvette on the go. And then we're going to get in and give it to the Dark Water. What I'm going to do as well, mind... Let's see if it doesn't kick us again when we go back and change the ship over. Let's have a look. Where are we? I want to manage my ships. Double barreled anaconda. That needs a bit of work for this. I've got a vulture here as well. Um, we're going to go for the old badger's fang. Yeah, going into Summerland. I did. A, there's a mega ship there. Got to have the pews on. Um... It's a mega ship there. As soon as you approach it, it takes you out. Because I thought I'll approach in a nice little nimble ship. Simon, how you doing? Scan it. Take the turrets out. Be on my way. As soon as you get close, and I think about 8k away from it, it kind of sort of lets you have it. Um, which is, which is a shame, really. Long time no chat. I've been watching you, Simon. I've been watching you on the Twitch. Changing changing the alliance states and, and the, the political states as well. How could you? Your own carrier shot you. Must have been very naughty boy. So what I'm going to do, um, I'm going to go in here. I fancy doing a bit of ground combat. And I'm at O'Hare's. O'Hare's Hangar, I think it is. In the Summerland system. Enlist in a faction war. Uh, we'll go for that one because it's close. So let's go to high. And I'm going to fight for them, the Summerland Patrons Party. Uh, and it's versus dark water. So we're gonna have a go at that. Goodbye. For deployment. Give them hell, soldier. Yeah, give them hell, commander. So a little bit of little bit of frontline solutions to get us going. Twelve anarchy systems. Oh, we gotta give that a go. Gotta give that a go. Let's get into the. Um, into the dropship. I mean, doing a bit of content as well, really. Uh, I'm due to travel next month, so I'll be away for a week. 
I know, travelling for work, eh? What's all that about? I kind of vaguely remember travelling for work. Um, and they're providing... I can meet all the visa requirements for the states and pass a proctored COVID test. Uh, I'll be off to Orlando for work, which would be great. Um, it'll be a good old conference while I'm over there. So I've been trying to get some content done, trying to get some content scheduled as well. Right, let me have a look. What is that then? The Good God, I'm gonna have to get my mouse over there and copy that. Um, yeah, I mean, I've been to, last time I went to Orlando was 22 years ago, holiday. Now it's gonna be, well, I'll be going a little bit earlier. Um, say two days earlier, bit of shopping, bit of Universal Studios, cause you can't get anywhere near Disney. On the Sunday, do the conference. And then um, back on the Thursday, landing Friday. And then War of the Worlds in Cardiff on the Saturday. Hopefully. Let's just see where um, Simon's... Oh, come on. Simon's stuff. Yeah, I'm quite looking forward to going back and seeing how it's changed. Because a lot would have changed in 20 years. Not just the rides and stuff, but like, you know, it's all expanded all the way over that one particular area. So I'm, I'm quite interested in to find out, you know, um, how much it's changed. So I'm quite excited about that. There we go. Not too far away. Let's put a bookmark. Um... We'll call it um, Simon's system. Add to my favorites. Save. There you go, you're famous now. So, ooh, Tony! Uh, Synthetics Assembly is where I'm going to go and do this particular battle. Um, I am rocking around in my, dare I say it, Maverick suit. And why not? Chaos system. Oh, excellent. Excellent. Well, I'll do a little bit of combat here. Um, tomorrow, I got things on. Unfortunately. So I may not be streaming tomorrow. More than likely, I will not be streaming tomorrow. Um, but I've got nothing else to do this afternoon. And God knows how long all this is going to go on for. And of course, there's the Colonia Bridge stuff where you could have warm cockpit lights. Well, warm cockpit lights. Um, ooh, I hear you all say. Not really sure warm cockpit lights is what I'm going to be after. What you want is going to be honking FSD. That's what you want. And I missed the last load. But do you want to be transporting loads of stuff back and forth, back and forth to the Colonial Bridge when you may or may not get an FSD? It does make you wonder, doesn't it? So I was doing a bit of this this morning and it was going quite well. A nice little bit of ship combat. Great. You're working on another anarchist system. Ah, I see. Turn it all to anarchy. That's what I see. Ugh. And I was thinking about what other games to play, to be fair. There's not much going on. Frontier have been really silent, or really quiet. It's all meant to be kicking off with their announcement streams next week. I was reading. So that's going to be interesting. Um, what do I get out of this? Oh, what do we get out of this? This, uh, it'll unlock cheaper Imperial ships, Imperial hammers. Well, I already have them. I just like doing the combat, to be honest with you. Um... 
for community goals, really. I mean, Imperial Hammer Railguns. Yeah, you know what? You're right. It's about time Frontier said something. I was looking at Diablo 3. Quite fancy another go at that. Played it years ago. Of course, it's all been redone and enhanced. That's something you can get your, your teeth into. And of course, Valheim has got a new section out. A frosty section with frosty ice caves. So that's quite good. So there's other, other stuff to be doing. There's the enemy up there. See him. Reinforcements are ready to deploy. <sighs> Missed him. Oh, I love this sniper rifle. It's brilliant. Someone just over there. Look, poking his head out. I'm trying my best not to do any of the... The missions with the rocket launcher because it kind of sort of makes a mockery of it. Boom! Kaboom. Oh, itchy nose. Right. You're already dead. Oh, no, I'm not. You're already dead. Look at that. Take them out. Here they come, walking down the street. Let's throw a grenade at them. Everyone's dead, Jim. I mean, the response on on the ground is a lot better. I come on, is he dead or what? He's dead now. Uh, let's do a bit of a little bit of this. I did, and I went off against the. Um, the Thargoids, and didn't do very well at all. I mean, it's still AX conflict stuff going on, isn't it? Uh, which is good. But my Thargoid builds need work. They really do need work. Um... Yeah, you know, backup support there. I'm always willing to have backup, to give backup support. But like with the Thargoids, it's just part of the game that really eludes me. It really is. How people can roll in there um, and incur minimal damage, I just don't know. Yeah, I'm terrible. I'm absolutely terrible. I mean, I got down to the last hurt. Great. Um, and then got completely, completely owned. It was it just wasn't even funny anymore. And that was an anaconda all tricked up. Why 
I got to get in here and shoot this guy. Just like that. Certainly have. That's the thing. I'm not sure they've, they've bumped them up a bit uh, in, in difficulty. I remember with my, my one crate that I had all set up, I had no problems. Now all of a sudden, you know, I'm getting completely owned all of the time. And for some reason, my key binding for my next grenade is gone. And I'm right in the middle of something. There's something, I don't know, just a bit relaxing about this, I find. And the pistol, I think, is great. Took him to church. They're all over there. Oh, I haven't been blown away yet. Not yet. I haven't lost a... I haven't lost a guy yet. I do like this sniper rifle. I really should start work on, on getting this sniper rifle upgraded. Here I am from my, my vantage point, my grassy knoll. Huh, couldn't it? Can it anything? What's going on here? Oh, good grief. Let's get in there. Yes, have it. What's in the case? Nothing that I can have. Um, let's charge up a bit. It is, yeah. I'm just doing this because I enjoy it. Well, I think it's shit-based. It's a shame they haven't done it so that, you know, Odyssey players as well can have a good go. I mean, you haven't got to do the ground stuff, have you? There's a window there. Enemy commanders called in backup. Bravo is online. Yes, I've got loads and loads and loads and loads of grenades now. Right, where's this enemy commander? Where's he gone? Oh, they're all the way over there. Look. Let's get over there. Come on. Grouped up. Coming in. Squad like. I don't know. We're going to go in here. They're coming in round the door. No, what the hell's going on here? No. Oh. Let's do it the old fashioned way. Dead. Ooh, not so bad. Yeah, well, I thought I'd have a go at this anyway. I've signed up for the community goal. 
and uh, I'll jump in the ship and, and get on with it. Like Dark Water is getting a kick in. And that's a kick in. Options. Controls. What controls? Uh, on foot. Book sprint. Open wheel. Throw grenade. Yes. Next tool. Yes. Next. H. Right. <clears throat> now I know it's H. Cheeky. Yeah, we're going to shoot him through that gap. Perhaps. Yeah, there we go. Gotta get a med pack. I'm a bit, I'm a bit busy. <laughs> it is a bit busy, it is a bit busy. one of these things now where you're shooting him so I am about to die Here we go, it's getting intense. I've got no shields left. I think there's two guys left, that's it. Shields back on. I think I capped him. No, I haven't. Out of all this, they're still going for me. I think we're done. Battle won. It's not so bad. I oh, know I have zero. I'm out of healing. I was out of healing. Yeehaw. Let's get us out of the dropship. I know. If someone looks at me nastily, I'll be dead. Easy. I enjoyed that. It's good to get a little bit of this, a little bit of that going on. Going to jump into the Corvette. Get into some mischief. Now I'll have to check see if there's any missions going on at the station to take out Dark Water people at the conflict zone. That'll be interesting stuff, if there is. Uh, 
Um, Ground-based combat. The main um, station in this area is Henry's... Oh, God, what is it called? It's called... Henry O'Hare's Haven. Is the planet and Henry O'Hare's hangar. That is... That's the station where everything seems to be based. So, that's pretty cool. There's the old... Uh, vulture Vulture. The female pilot. All good stuff. Won't be long to be getting. Well, that old combat rank isn't going up much, is it? Which is a shame. Get into the ship. Get into some conflict zones. See, uh... Yeah, do you know what? I mean... That could be the way to do it, really. Oh, you wanted to do one of these, anyway. That's all I really wanted to do. So, Frontier Developments have been a bit on the quiet side. Have they not? Would anyone like to speculate on what's coming? Something big could be coming. Are they going to announce a roadmap? Or what? Are, people, are they going to move away from roadmaps? Because that sets like an expectation from the players. That's the thing, isn't it? If you look what happened with Star Citizen, they've gone, yeah, we're not doing roadmaps anymore. Um, they're just causing more problems. Just stuff's coming. Okay. I mean, they really have to start thinking about a console release soon, or a lot of players are just going to walk out the door, if they haven't already done so. Yeah, well, it's, it's it. See, I mean, update 11. But what are we going to get? Brutal Enforcer. Yeah, I listened to the Burr Pit thing today as well. I mean, they've got a couple of licenses. They got this. Right. Planet Coaster. I don't really know if that's doing that well. Not really my bag. Um, there's a Warhammer game coming out. Um, and they got Jurassic Park. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's, um, you know, I think that is just a rumour. Given that, you know, Bungie has been bought and, you know, PlayStation have bought somebody else and, you know, and all the rest of it. They're all buying up the games. So I, I watched it this morning. Could it be time to buy some stock in Frontier Developments? I don't know how low it is. I think it got to about 16, 17, didn't it? But like, who's playing their games? Well, even with the fleet carrier interiors, right? Is that really going to give people the sort of like the advanced gameplay they're going to need? I mean, yeah, you walk around it. It'll be great for about a week. And then... I mean, 7,000 to 9,000 daily. It isn't bad. Is it? I mean, it's not brilliant like what it used to be in its heyday, but then, you know, other games have come out. Look at all these missions. Ooh. Settlement massacres. 
and all that. Let's go and cash in. Jump in the ship. Get out of the way. There are conflicts all over the system that need sold. You want to cash in your bonds? No problem. Here we go. Eight million for that. It's all right, wasn't it? Eight million. Bye. To the ship, Batman. To your hangar. Into the Corvette. Well, it's true, isn't it? You know, when there is no news, then shadow news happens. You're right. Speculation is, is key for all of that. You know? Um... And some, sometimes, it's not even pure speculation, it's just wishful thinking. This is where I find about the wrong end of the bloody... I'm the wrong shit. <laughs> 1,300... No, that's 13 pounds a share. That's 1,324 pence. Yeah, well, exactly. That's, that, that's the problem, isn't it? You know, it's... I mean, as pretty and as nice as Start Citizen... You know... Um, is. And it is pretty... It's just too much of a fag to get involved. It keeps cancelling all the stuff that you want to do. Um, let's look at the missions. Mission board. Combat. Assassinate, 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 assassinate. Kill Summerland patrons' principals. We don't want to do that. We want to kill dark water ships. Yeah, we'll do that. Look at that. What's that for? 54 ships. Cool. Why not? Kill dark water ships there. What's that? Another 40 ships. Am I going to kill 100 ships? Probably not. Let's have a go. Loads of ships we can we can destroy there. Um, right, let's get cracking. Let's get into the advancement. Let's make sure we got some limpets. Purchase limpets. Let's have some limpets. Confirm. Uh, let's make sure we've got our dude with us. Crew lounge. Cedric, set Cedric to, um, to be in the dude. Launch. Ah, that's it. It's at 1,324 pounds a share. Christ, that's more than Microsoft. Simon, you're quite right there. I don't even bother watching the videos, to be fair. Go. So I've got another... Exterminate scavengers mission there. Well, we'll do that in a minute. The few other ones I've pulled out for some reason. Oh, we'll get to them in a minute. Let's get to a conflict zone. Yes. Yeah, exactly. It was £32. It was way up there.
We're going in. Here we go. Ooh. All right, where is everybody? I want to fight for that faction. Right. Smash him up. Oh, it's a nice backdrop with that planet, isn't it? He's gone. Who's next? Let's give him a hammer in. I think so as well. Is a I'm sure there's a system unlock. There was a quite a few things you got for this, of which I don't think there was an awful lot I really wanted. We've already done the Imperial Hammer's power play. Turn that on so we can see what we're doing. Oh, there's loads of pews going on. Loads of pews going on. Look at this. All this hassle. What have they done with the expert viper? My god, look at that. Just die, will you? Die. Die, scum. Next. Ooh, look. Not an asp scout. I'll have this guy instead. It's a little viper. A viper vulture. I haven't launched my fight here. I will in a minute. Let's get Cedric. Earning his money. Right in, Cedric. Let's go. Yeah, exactly. I mean, I, I'm exactly the same as you, Joel. I'm already... I've already got those ranks. And in the next three weeks, I'll have all the power play modules as well, which means the only thing I haven't got is Guardian Hell Reinforcement, which I'll go and unlock in future weeks. I think I'm aligned now to the guy with the blonde dreadlocks, boss's name. Him. Anyway, he's got the Kryto Scrambler, and I've been leaving that right to the very end because, you know, I don't think it's really worthwhile. I'm just doing it for completeness, so I've played every aspect of the game. Um, oh no, the fighter's destroyed. Did a good old job then, didn't he? Tough little ships, those vultures. Look at this. Alliance Challenger. The vulture isn't me. I've been I've been using mine. 
Um, there we are, look, we're sucking down his shields. It does. It does need a lot of engineering. You're right. Um, bit like the Mamba. The Mamba is just useless without decent engineering. Let's get these shields down, shall we? They're offline. He's throwing the tinsel out the windows. Lord Narco Wookie. Yes, well... I was having real problems Thargoid hunting. Couldn't even take a Cyclops down with my engineered Thargoid build, which means the build needs more work. Or I'm useless without Mike and Simon in my corner when I'm hunting Thargoids. Which is more likely what it is. But you watch people on there and it's bang, 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 dead. You know, you've seen it with the, the Guardian Shard cannons. I thought, I'm going to have myself some of that. And it's all because they've got premium ammunition, you know. And even with premium ammunition, I still get owned. It's like this build here with all the multi cannons. I might take some of the multi switch some of the multi cannons around for beam lasers, so I can stay in the fight a bit longer. But then, it's the capacitance and the charge I find. Let's get another fighter out. Oh, scouts. Scouts all day long. All day long with the scouts. I think my AX uh, build with the turrets, my challenger I had, was great. I think I very much sort of got it. I think with the Thargoids, it's more of a clan-based system to take them out anyway. Because certain ships will give you support. You know? Right, I'm under attack. Brilliant. <sighs> Who's attacking me? Everyone's attacking me. So let's attack him. Oh, is that right? I did a sync with EDSM last week. Yeah, that crate, the crate mark two is great for hunting scouts as well, you know, and they're saying, you know, it's, it's a good ship as well for the, 
the interceptors. And I used to do pretty well with it. Boosting away and all that and what have you. Uh, but now, not so much. Nice meaty ship to shoot. All these little things. They're a right pain. PS King 4 EVA, how are you? See you later. Um, let's, let's just get after this vulture, viper, let's smash him up, smash him up. Yeah, the Salvation Shard cannons are brilliant, aren't they? He's toast. Ooh, look, we've got a python. I do like a larger ship. I have a go at. Yeah, I don't know why limp why why limpets are not picking the stuff. I must be too far away. Right, here we go. Where is he? Where's he gone? There he is. Right, ha ha! Smash him up, smash him up, smash him up. So they're all coming in. They're coming in after us. Take his shields down. Smash him up. Battle one. Reputation. Significant decrease for dark water. Oh no. Let's pick up some stuff. Yeah, we've got some limpets on the go. What we got coming in? What we got possibly can we pick up? Proprietary composites. Mmm. High density composites. Look at all that good stuff there. Conductive components. Yes. Bring them to me. Bring them to me. <laughs> 
couldn't hit a cow's ass with a banjo. <laughs> yeah, so it's been a long time since I've heard that saying. But yeah, you're right. Um, unless you've got a smaller ship, a small nimble ship. Or you've really upgraded the thrusters. It's very difficult to get a get a hit with um, non-gimbaled weapons on a larger ship. However, the shotguns, the, the, the cannons, the shard cannons, you know, uh, like the pacifier. Get the double barreled upgrade on them as well. You get a nice wide spread. Gimbaled weapons are just easier. You know, I'm a great fan of gimbaled weapons. Has to be said. And all this stuff. Electrochemical arrays. Let's get over there. Come on. <laughs> yeah, so I'm, I'm not a fan of difficulty in games. Um, I like a challenge, but like that's sometimes ridiculous. Have I fitted a 7 8? No, I haven't. Um, I've got. I should have. I'm still using my old Collect Olympic controller there. That's what I'm using. I think I fitted the 7A to the Imperial Cutter that I'm building for combat. Okay, Joe, see you in a bit. Eight collectors. I know it's worthwhile, isn't it? We're doing all right there, though. Right, let's get this fighter back in then. Copy, Commander. Bringing the fighter back to the bay now. And we can jump out, jump back in. In out, shake it all about. Right, that's it. Brilliant. That's the way. Hope you got the fighter in. No, he's still docking. Come on, man. You're elite for God's sake. Has he got it in yet? Ooh, uh. Right. Jump. It does, and it's worthwhile, I think. I can't remember what shields I've got on this, to be honest. What shields have I got on this? I got seven prismatics on this. I should. You're totally, totally right. I'll have to get myself over with the Shinrata and buy myself some of those. William, have a nice evening, mate. Okay, we're going back in. So far, we have got nearly a million. Nearly a million.
Ooh, oh no, someone's attacking me, everybody. Let's take out that cobra. Give him a smash in, smash him up, smash him up, smash him up. Look at this. I'm be I'm getting owned. I'm gonna have to run away. Look at this. Shields are nearly down. Everyone attacked me. We're not having this though. We're going back in right now. The hell was that down there? Let's do a reboot. Mighty Agu, greetings to you as well on this happy Saturday afternoon. No rugby this weekend. <clears throat> I know, I know. Next weekend though, whew, big Super Saturday, I think. Shields back online. Let's get that fighter on the go. Right, him. We're going after that anaconda. Ooh, he's all tricked up. Look at him. Oh, we're on him. We're on him, all right. We're going in. He's having it right up the trumpet. Look at that. Got the cannons, giving it to him. shields. Yeah, he doesn't like it up him now, does he? Oh no, the fighter's destroyed. Um, oh, is it? Kapow, next. Right, who's next? Who's next on my list? This guy. This guy's on my list. Oh, we're so going after him. Here's little Cobra Mark III. God, he zipped off quick, didn't he? Leading us away from the fight, he is. Never mind, we'll get we'll come back to him. Do you know what? It does. It does need to be cross-platform, you're right.
Oh, we're going to take this guy to church. Look at the speed on him. He's coming right at us, as they say in South Park. Okay, what's next? Here he is. Too right, it does need to be cross-platform. It really does need to be cross-platform. But like this, these community goals are something that both Odyssey and, you know, um, Horizons players and console players can do. Just unfortunately not on the same platform. So I understand what you're saying. It should be cross-platform, but I'm sure someone somewhere said there was a reason for why it couldn't be. I mean, other games do it. Why can't this bunch? <clears throat> Go on, next. Let's deploy him. Oh yeah, can you imagine that? Can you imagine the bugs? I mean, there was always the rumours that a lot of people who wrote the original Cobra OS that it's based on have left. And um, this is, again, this is rumour. This is not me throwing shade. This is just rumour that we hear like. You know, and... By thinking they could just tack on a bit of the game. But we see how that worked. We obviously didn't we? Hasn't quite worked out like they wanted. Especially for console commanders. I mean, on the PC, yeah, great. You know, gotta say it. I'm having a blast. But it's been nearly a year since release. Well, ten months since release. I think, and now it's getting to a playable state. I mean, what sort of state the base game is on the consoles is like, I think it's a different, it's a completely different kettle of fish. Well, yeah, I, I, like this morning, I, I did a bit of work on this, did some content for the channel, and then I thought, right, okay, well, let's see what Valheim's up to. And I enjoyed Valheim, I really did. It was, you know, it was great. In fact, I'm still enjoying it, because even, don't forget, that's in Alpha. You know, Alpha. And, um... Again, you know, good gameplay. What they're going to do now to, to spice it up, God only knows. I mean, really, I want another game a bit like Subnautica. And it's quite interesting that Unknown Worlds, who themselves have also been bought out, have advertised for um, a development manager of the next Subnautica game. So they're already starting to think about it. Minus the cargo. <laughs> yeah, I was watching people play, you know, Truck Simulator as well, and that just seems way too advanced. The guy wasn't even talking on the stream, you know? It was just, it was all happening. He had his hat on. He had his, um, 
bespoke controllers already. He had a trucker check shirt on. He was going for it. You know? He really was. He was having a good old go. You start with a garage and a wreck, and then you start driving for 5,000 kilometers. Cool, Mike. Okie dokie, let's get you in. There you go. That sounds like good fun. So I'm looking I'm looking for a game. I mean Farming Simulator was good for a while, but then I just kinda got fed up with that. You know, more various Oh, it's a different tractor. Oh, okay. Um Though I enjoyed it for, you know, a good four to five weeks. That's kind of all I played. Yeah, I found with Farming Simulator, you know, it fell down when you were doing olives or grape farming. You know, that auto mode, <clears throat> that was a manual thing. And that was perhaps the hardest part of the game, you know. So it does need work. Really good, though. Another patch coming for that soon, I hear. He's gone. Get him. Then a runner. <clears throat> I want a ship to shoot. That's nice and meaty and is not going to run off its tails between its legs. Which it looks like they're all doing. sub-target their drives. I keep forgetting to... The target the drives and the turrets and all the rest of it. His power plant's popped. Cheeky little vulture by here. Who's shooting missiles at me? Point defense is giving it good ones. Yeah, I'm kind of hoping carrier interiors are going to come next month. I've got a sneaky feeling they might not, though. Gonna be a year anniversary thing, I think. There'll be a big huzzah for it. 
There you go. Everyone will say, oh, okay. Right, this guy here who's popping missiles at me. Him. Who is it? Oh, here we are, look. Mr. Viper Mark IV, man. Right then, Chief. Know where you can stick your missiles. Two, two billion. I bet you went straight to Pathfinder, did you? Battle won. Cool stuff. Um, right. Battle win, they say. Well, yeah, I mean, I don't know how they're going to do it. I mean, I've got all the modules on my carrier, which is why it's not very good for community goals. Um, and the Colonia Bridge thing. So what I was thinking was... Once that's done and I've had a good look around and I've made my content and it's great, cut it down a bit because I don't want to sell ships. Um, you know, don't want to sell ships there. What's the point? Cut it down to a more manageable area. And then I can, you know, readdress situations like but they desperately need more in-game content. That's what they need. Ah, right. Ah, right, yeah. I think trade, I think, is the easiest one to get. And a lot of people get by default because, you know, elite in trade, I wouldn't say it's easy, it's not. There are lots of ways to get that. Even by doing the community goals and all the rest of it, you, you, you stand to get... Um, you know, you stand to get a higher ranking just by typically playing the game. Then exploration, well, just honking the horn is great. Going in and scanning those planets, that's what gets you the big exploration. Well, yeah, I mean, they've got to try and change the way, you know, the ranks are earned. I mean, you know, like a lot of people, right? I'm triple elite. I only got triple elite last year and I've been playing for seven years. You know, but I haven't got up to a next level for elite, even with all this combat that I'm doing. So God knows what you need. How did you get to Elite 5? How? We're going to have to wait and see. Yeah, mining expansion missions probably. But we're picking up a load of swag here. We are loads of swag. Uh, which is great. Just going to see how much... I'm going to have to go and rearm, Mike. It won't take long.
I mean, I could rearm here, but I don't want to use the materials. Yeah, I know. I need to go and rearm, though. On the squash. Cut down drinking February is not is going pretty well at the moment. Yeah, you're right there. I mean I got trade elite one but the same sort of time. Okay, so here we go. Henry O'Hare's Hanger, we're gonna we're gonna drop in there. No, we're not, because I'm going too fast and I've overshot it. It's gonna be the loop of shame. Loop of shame, is it gonna be loop of shame? No, it's not. Ooh. Meta alloys, man. Meta alloys. That is the stuff. That's right, yeah. They hadn't they hadn't resynced it. I mean they're like rocking horse. They are now. Meta alloys. A lot of the old forests they've gone. Meta alloy farming forests. I was kinda hoping that they're going to sort of get their act together and um, do the landing on Earth type worlds. But that might just be a little bit too ambitious, I think, for a game like this. It doesn't have to be ambitious. Fractal generated worlds. Oh yeah, the crystal forests do, yeah. In fact, I'm going to have to go and do that. And we're down. Um, blah, 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 blah. Excellent. Right. Um, <clears throat> From my missions, you can share two missions. I'm going to share that mission with you, Mike. Let's launch. Get on with it. Yeah, exactly. I mean, my alt account is, well, I've got three. I just don't log into one because it's brand new commander account. And that's my... Um, That's my epic Elite Dangerous account. This is standard Elite. I got a Steam one as well. That's in Colonia. So I wanted to do some stuff and you unlock some of the Colonia engineers. Oh, that'd be cool. That would be cool. I did have a plan of, of doing Colonia stuff on a Saturday and then standard stuff on a Sunday. That was that was the plan. Uh, it hasn't quite worked out that way, though. Unfortunately. Here we go, we're going in.
have a permit to jump there. Um, boom, 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 boom. Well, any of the surrounding systems that have got an allegiance to Cirrus. I would say. Yeah, planning ahead never works out. Because something like this happens. They think, oh, I'm going to do some of that. <clears throat> Let's get... Cedric in the fighter. Let's get to... A fight for this faction. Right, okay, we're here. We've arrived. Let's give these guys a bit of a smash in. Let's slow it down. Yeah, I mean, you know, I, I'm quite enjoying the conflict zones. Has to be said. Quite enjoying that. Well, yeah, that would be the good thing with, um, with the Apex, isn't it? That's going to be the key thing to do, I think. And I was just thinking, you want, if you want to get a mission giver as well, I mean, that would be cool on your carrier, but I don't think that's going to be the way they're going to do it. All right, where's this bloody vulture? There he is. Give him a smashing. We're giving him a smashing. Well, local missions for the system should be good. A local missions broker. That could be key to the success of this. And then, you know, they, they truly are going to be... Well effectively what they are, which are mobile stations, aren't they? Because so far, there's no, you know, you, you get a, you've got a, the hammerhead, is that, is it, the victory class, the victory class carrier, right? Well, isn't it looking a bit more aggressive than, you know, the, the Nautilus one? Neptune, Neptune, which is exploration, and very sort of like 2001 A Space Odyssey with the dome at the front. This one's very much like uh, the Hammerhead Corvettes we saw on Rogue One. But, you know, it doesn't... That's just a, It's just a skin. I thought they would have had specific roles, like, you know? Oh, he's getting a smash. Look at that. Smash him up, smash him up, smash him up, smash him up, up, up. Go on, next. This guy in the Challenger. Well, crew, that would be good. That would be good. You know, flag your colours. Away you go. I, I think it needs to be more, getting more to its, back to the fact of a simulation. Instead of loads of games being tacked into one, if that makes any sense.
His drive is out. He is spinning like a spinny thing. Yeah, I think people will be very happy with that. They need that sort of... Well, okay, you've got that crew. Well, can you send them on missions? A bit like how No Man's Sky, you can dispatch ships from your fleet. So, you know, on my carrier, I've got a captain, and I've got a quartermaster, and I've got a this, and I've got a that, and I've got someone who runs the commodity market, and, and, and God knows whatever else. Right? And that's great. But what good are they to me? Why can't I send the captain off on a mission? Go and reinforce this one particular base. Four of them off they go. Now that would be something. Looks like we got more than one target to contend with, Commander. <laughs> PSTV, yeah, I know, I know exactly what you mean. It's wishful thinking. Ooh, look at this, a Type 9 Heavy. That's got to be worth coming after, isn't it? Mike's already on him. On it like a car bonnet, look. We're coming in. Gonna be gone. He's gone. Ford Prefect and a taxi driver called Ezra Miller today. Commander Faye Sky, thanks for the follow. Everyone likes to shoot a good Chris Roberts. Where's this? This guy here. This guy here needs shooting all day long. He's in an ASP scout, for God's sake. Thank you very much, Commander. Ah, uh, I think he's gone. Uh, who's the next one? Um, ha. Well, this is a private game, you see, so you know we're like-minded individuals here. I'm sick of fighting vipers. I want to fight something a bit more tasty. What have we got? It's going to be one of those, I suppose. Here 
Here we are, giving the guy a good pasting. Give him a pasting. His shields are down. Someone's threatening to punch my ticket. Oh no. I've just started watching on Amazon Prime as well, Man in the High Castle. Right? I'm only in season one. Brilliant. And I tried watching it about two years ago. Couldn't get into it. But now seems to be the right time is four seasons. Seems to be a really good program if you haven't seen it. Really good. Ooh, look at that. We chewed him out then. Has he gone? He's gone. Next. Ugh, it's got to be a viper, isn't it? Here we go. A wing of three anacondas. So I take it you survived. Is this guy just... Where's he gone? Is he spinning off somewhere or what? I think his drive's down. Let's get back in the fight. Who have we got close? No one. Oh well, we'll have to be him then. Oh, well, that's all right then. Otherwise, that could have really spoilt your day if they were, like, higher ranked. And we clipped him as well. We got the shields to take that. Here we go. gone. Looks like he's gone. We're running it we're running out of dark water people. Everyone seems to be converging on this poor fella. Here's little vulture. Look at that. Different coloured beams of laser everywhere. Anaconda, 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 Anaconda. Where is he? There he is. Oh, 
Ah, oh, see, so start the charges. Shields back up with the shield cell bank. They're nearly down. Come on, big guns giving them a good thrashing. Look at that, all those decompressive explosions. You've got to say it for the anaconda. When it when it dies, you know, it dies in style. So all my, my Olympic controllers are working overtime. Yeah, sure there is. Um, add me as a friend. A little bit preoccupied at the moment, it has to be fair. Um, add me as a friend and um, I can add you in. It's a private group session, so you're looking for Commander Rich Owen. Oh, he's not running. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. No, no, we don't. Oh, no, you don't. You're not running. Thank you. Another python. He's coming in by the look of it. Yeah, you, that is right. Rich Owen. Okay, Joe. Take it easy, dude. And he's down. Later, Joe. Uh, pending friend request. That's you. Um, should be auto now. So if you get yourself and you want to join, you want to join, um, my private game. No problem. It should should you should be able to auto join. Oh, 
Right. Someone's going to be shooting at me now by the look of it. Who's this? This guy here. Let's take him out. All the lasers. This guy with his shield cell banks as well. Um, okay, let's see who else we can shoot. Okay, here we go. It's the Corvette V Viper. Viper Mark IV, let's be precise about this. Okay, here we go. Yes, taking him out. Where's he gone? Where's he gone? Where's he gone? There you are, no valid targets. I think we might have won that one. Let's get the collectors out and about. I have set it to auto add. Um, you're on the main menu. Groups. Let's have a look. Friends. There you are. You're right there. Invite to private group. Please try again later. Um, don't know why. We should have be able to have loads of members there. We haven't got that many members, see? Yeah, it might be a relog thing. Who knows? Who knows what they're doing to this game? Yeah. What have we got coming in here? These two collect limpets. Let's bring the fighter back.
So we've killed Dark Water ships. How many have we killed? Then we've killed loads. How many have we killed? 20 out of 54. So it's not stackable uh, at the moment. Right. Um, how am I doing for bullets? Retrieval complete. Ship is locked down. I reckon I got another battle in me. I think. Or should I go? I think I might go and rearm. I might go and rearm there now, Mike. <laughs> yeah, the relog might do it. I've invited you, Commander Bloody Wolf. I'm going to go and rearm. Let's hope he doesn't fall over now. We've got people joining. That's the big hope. I'm going too fast. I'm going too fast. Is it going to let me in? Come on. Yes. <laughs> That's the sort of stuff I like doing, you know? Total chaos, like what we do in the military installations. But you've got to fly in, pick everybody up, and get out. Everyone does their bit. Someone takes the the guns out. Someone loots the place and completes the mission, you know, or or gets what the mission parameters are. Then someone's the getaway driver. That's the stuff I like doing. Ah! See, I was talking. I was talking and I didn't, um... Didn't ask for permission to land. That could have been really embarrassing, couldn't it? Let's see. There you are, look, you're on main menu. Invite the team unreachable. It is. Um, ooh, someone's being a naughty person down there. Look at that, look. Detected at the front door. Oh great, there's motion detected at the front door. Cool. Let's get in there. Following the greens. Pad 17. There we are. And we're down. Right. 
Let's pay this fine off. Ah, 96. 96. I don't even know what that is. 96 billion earned already. Um, I don't even know what's going on. And it's four days left of it. I haven't done any of this guff yet. Um, top 50% so far. Um, and I haven't done virtually anything. Um, you know to be fair. Where am I? Um, let's go over here. Transactions. I've learned, earned 11 million credits. That's not bad, is it? Okay, let's have a look. Um, boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 friend request. There you go. Um, you're at the main menu, and you're at the main menu. Strange, isn't it? Eight mil was from ground missions. Yeah, and that was that was the ground missions was great. I really enjoyed that. Right, where are we? Um, advanced maintenance. Some limpets. And I'm just going to go away from the keyboard to get a drink. I'll be back in a moment.
That's better. Let's have a look. Yeah. Okay. I don't know what's going on with the private group session. Anyway. Uh... Let's go, go, go. Go, 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 gadget Corvette. Here we go. Right in. We're lined up. I always keep doing that. Navigation. Conflict zone. I think what we'll do, we'll do this one. And then if you're all up for it, we'll pop in and we'll do a ground mission. Because that's surely to break the game. You never know. Okay, here we go, here we go. They are... Uh, and we're not even doing anything too funky. Let's launch the fighter, deploy Cedric. Two. Fight for this faction. Let's get in there, get going. Guns out. Cobra, let's go. His shields are down. Goodbye, shields. ramming speed then he just glanced off us you know no problems he's gone who's next time he got into the fight they're all over there it would seem This Herbert, yeah. Look at him. In his Asp Scout. We're going right for him. There he is. Ooh, an anaconda. Ooh, he's mine. He is mine. Give him a good smash in. He 
He's starting to treat trying to recharge his shields. The engineered shields? Why are they glowing green? Hmm. Ooh, nearly rammed him then. Got his power plant targeted. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. We're nose to nose. We're going for another one. He's coming right at us. We're giving it a smash in. He's so big, I'm not sure the chaff at that side, at this distance is gonna make the blindest bit of it. We're still scoring hits. That's your favourite thing, isn't it? Simon, commanders falling out of the ship whilst in hyperdrive. So that was it for that anaconda. Excuse me. Thank you, Jules. We're going to slow it down a bit. Because it's rain, I'm allergic to tree pollen. And you can imagine with all this wind as well at the moment and the sort of mild weather we've been having, it's been terrible lately, or terrible today. Ha, <laughs> scurvy peanuts. If only. Right, his drives are out. That guy's gone. Um, I'll send the fighter after him. Yeah, he's just spinning off. Right, who's next? Uh, some cheeky monkey over there. Three, six, two, oh, vipers. Just so uninspiring, aren't they? Right, we're going right at him. Yes, have it. Yeah, well, that's because you're in a hot climate. I can't even grow mint over here. It's ridiculous. We've got a veg truck out the backyard. So, oh, come on, we'll grow our own herms. Dead. Nothing. And now, the cover blew off in the high winds. Right? <laughs> so we're stuffed. Can't even grow mint. Firing his purple stuff at me from his little asp explorer.
Go on, next. Ooh, a challenger. Crusader, sorry. Yes, yeah, so it's all it's all died off now, is it, Simon? Which I'd imagine. It's amazing when you grow your own stuff how much more potent it is compared to the shop stuff, isn't it? You know, you, you, it's like you don't realise what the hell they do to it. All that flash freezing, it just kills the flavour and stuff. He's gone, who's next? Oh, a cheeky little, little eagle. That's gonna be worthwhile shooting, isn't it? Here he comes. Yeah, well, I'm kind of hoping it's going to be hot. I mean, I got this this um, this work trip coming up in March, so Orlando is meant to be between 13 degrees and 24 degrees in March, which is which is obscene. Oh, it's not Australia temperatures, I know, like you know, but. That's hot. That's hot, you know. That's hot stuff. And then we should be into our sort of like, we always get nice weather around about Easter time. Yep, <laughs> Diablo, that's right mate, too right. And being the given the runaround by this little. Cool stuff. Let's make sure I've got that mission shared for everybody. Think we're anywhere near it yet, mind. Um, maybe you there on that one. 27 degrees at midnight. Man, the country's just too hot. Ooh, a python. Let's go, and, let's go and spoil his day.
Who's next? Who's next? Who's next? Aha. Him. He's next. We were all getting carried away. He's gone. Who's next? He's shooting at me. Is he right? Okay. You and your ASP scout. What's that, Tony? Is this guy going to come anywhere near me then, or what? I don't know. Gone. Gonna. A gone gonna. Okay. Time for the vulture now. Still pulling in some materials. Have a look, where is he? Where's he gone? There he is. Cheeky little python right there. Give him a smack in. He's trying to refresh his shields. Look. The shield cell bank. Those shields, they be glowing the green. That guy's got a lot of heat from doing that, theoretically. He shouldn't be able to do an awful lot of shooting. I mean, that's a complete charge right there. Of my um, of my beam lasers, and he's still trying to refresh those shields. Now his shields are down. We got him. Got him with the guns. rip into him.
Oh, you're not going anywhere, Chief. Right, we are on a roll. We're on a roll, Commander. Yes, yes, we're on rolls. Ham rolls, cheese rolls, sausage rolls. We should be nearly done with all this. Piddly little ships. That's all it is. So, you know, all these big ships, you know, there's, there's Mike's Cutter, there's Bloody Wolves, Corvette, my Corvette, and this guy is still, you know, trying to go toe to toe. Three clicks out, crazy. Nice chieftain right there. He's coming right at us. Yeah, exactly. They're hanging on. They are hanging on by a thread when they say, right, we're going to run. And it's quite an intense combat zone for a low intensity combat zone. This is the thing, this is low. Okay, we got pretty tricked out ships, but this this is still, you know, I wouldn't say it's challenging. It's good fun. As soon as that tinsel stops, mate, I'm going to give you a thrashing. Here it is. Get the beam lasers. Get the guns out. Look at that. You can throw all the tinsel you want out your windows. It's not going to make the blindest bit of difference.
And he's gone. We've got a sneaky python. Ooh, uh, no one likes a sneaky python. It is good fun, isn't it? Got to get ourselves over there. We are all shooting that one guy. Look at that. I mean, this is, this is, you know, good, I wouldn't say, well, it is, it's good mindless fun, isn't it, right? Good mindless fun, little bit of space combat. In a ship, you know, they can't really touch you in, unless you really take your eye off the ball. See, 7% hell. He's trying to run. No difference. Okay, here we go. We're coming in. Than ah, aha. No, oh. now it seems like a national crusader convention. Look at it, crusaders everywhere. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Got a challenger. These can be tough little ships.
his drives out. I've taken his drive out. We should be after him now. He's trying to get away with us. With his one drive, he's all imbalanced. sure really closing quickly on him he's spinning so much away yeah sure Simon we just finished this guy and pop to instead of going back and rearming I am going to if I can rearm That'll do us. We're back in the we're back in the fight. Right. Viper shooting. Here we go. All good fun in a conflict zone. Yeah, I try and get mine oh, at least over 20. Um, but, you know, with the combat ships and the tanking, I mean, that's heavy, you know? There's not an awful lot you can really do to save. Save weight if you're putting a true combat ship in. got chaff of me. Look at him. Look at him. Is he gone yet? Nearly, nearly, nearly. Come on, swing back round. Yeah, that's right. I mean, it's about 25, isn't it? 23, 25, depending on whether you've done the, the lightweight scanners and and life support sort of stuff. Um, this one seems to be going on for ages. Ooh, Anaconda. 
Yes. Kapow. Oh, I love these. Look at this. Webcam.xyz. Yeah, hot girls, baby. <laughs> oh, my God. This, this is pretty good fun, you know? God, he zoomed away, didn't he? Is he going to come back, do you reckon? I don't know. Oh, here he comes. 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 He's gone. Who's the next one? Oh. Ooh, Asp Explorer. I don't... <sighs> Hardly what you call a combat ship. Explorer ship? Yes. Combat ship? No. It's like a flying dinner plate. You know, I mean, I spend a lot of time in those ships. I know, it's amazing, isn't it? Oh my god! He's expert. What, what is he? Is he made out of brick or something? Look at him. He should have been dead twenty minutes ago. Look at him. It's amazing. My fully tricked up Asp Explorer would never last this long. Never. Let's take this guy's shields down. Yeah, all it is is hell reinforcements, nothing else. You know, and having a combat ship like that, you know, you can't jump anywhere. You're limited to class two and class one hard points. You know, it makes you wonder, like, you know, what, why? <laughs> Look at this. Warrior. Another Asp Explorer. Mm-hmm. Yes, Warrior. He's a warrior. Shame he couldn't have sprung for a better ship. Like, I don't know, Python, perhaps. That's more like it. He's out of it. Ramming speed.
Right, here he comes. Look, look at the speed he's coming in. Well, this one, this one's been going on for the best part of an hour. <laughs> um, five million in claims I've got on this one. This is mad. Target shields are flying. Oh, it's got to be bugged, but, you know, hey, I'll take it all day. There he is, taking him out. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Ooh. He's gone, who's next? They just keep on coming, don't they? Hmm? God, I need a rest. His shields are down. Why is he trying to redo his shields? That's just a vain hope. Please, shields, please come back. Last window. Um, who's next? Here we go. So, I don't know who got hit with caustic. I don't know. I didn't. I don't think I did.
Is this guy going to attack or what? We're chipping away at him. At a distance. Where's he gone? Where's he gone? Where's he gone? There he is. Right. God, tough little shit, man. Come on. Is that crate mark too? They've got caustic missiles. I I haven't seen. I haven't been hit with one yet. I want to try and get some of this, the balance right on, um... I think this build is too machine gun reliant. I might swap two of those small machine guns out with... with beams. Put a machine gun on the bottom. Try and balance it out that way. Let's get after this guy. Here he is, here he is, here he is. Whoa, that. I mean, effectively, their method is jousting. Right? That's all they're doing when they're coming back and forth and doing their runs. It's a very sort of a jousting type of engagement. Yeah, the Healy Beams. Good old Healy Beams. Yeah, machine guns, I mean, a good go in. It's 
turn my lights on. There we go, that's a bit better. A bit gone a bit disco because the kids have been playing with it. Here he comes again. The Asp Explorer. Warrior ship. Ah. <laughs> ah, GB's the DPS. Yeah, he's too right. Okay, here we go, here we go. Is he gonna go this time? No, he's not. He's still using that tinsel rubbish. Where's he gonna go now? Ah, we're crashing into everybody. Total carnage. Right, there he is. Give him a smash, giving him a smash. Yes. Now we should have torn right the way through that. He's competent, for Christ's sake. Ooh, Anaconda. So far, so good. 2% shield. Hard ship, see? Hard ship. <laughs> this poor eagle, we're all shooting him. Look at it. Look. <laughs> He's like, oh, turn on the, the FSD drives. Turn on the FSD drives quick. Bang. Man, we are shooting ships left, right, and centre here. I just can't... I just can't believe the shield strength on some of them. I mean, look at this guy. He's in a Viper Mark IV, for Christ's sake. Okay. Uh, who we got left? Who have we got left?
Right. I've got to step away from the keyboard a bit. I'm just going to set my shields to full and go that way. My fight is in defense.
And I'm back. Ha! <laughs> Mission invite from Commander Simon, eh? Yes. Ah, right, okay, there you are. Only 22 kilometers away, that's not bad, is it? How, how are we doing on that one? I think we did alright, did we? Okay. Ugh. I was just bought. Well, I say just me. Kids, right? They like beige food to eat, right? Everyone's rearming. Good idea. Sod the fighter, let's go. So my missus goes out now and buys a boneless feast from Kentucky Fried Chicken. Do you know what? I reckon the box might have been tastier. It was dry, it was a, you know, horrible stuff. Lord Narco Wookie. Yeah, I mean, money to be, money to be made, man. Money to be made. Let's get back in and rearm. What about doing, what about doing a ground mission at this station? Everyone get out, go in, let's do a one ground conflict mission. How about that? Might be all right. <laughs> McDonald's here has run out of their chicken Big Mac. And there was uh, one place in Bristol. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got it. We got it. We got it. Like, you know. Uh, they were queuing around the block for it. I know. I know. I know. It's, sh it's a shame, isn't it? You can always get a team up next time. You're right. What's going on yet? God's sake. I've done it again, haven't I? Oh, contacts. Come on, where is it? There. Request docking. Thank you. I'll be fair, son. We do play odd hours. Go. We're going in, we're going in. Had two. Okay, so what do you all say about disembarking and trying a ground mission? Huh, look, I'm being spammed. <laughs> oh dear. Love it, get the engagement up, I don't care. Do, do, do. Oh, 
The concourse. Okay. We're all here. Um on the ground. Are you ready to fight? Yes, go to the terminal and hand all that in, I suppose. Complete missions. I'll go for the many, baby. Many, 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 baby. Many, 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 many. Right. Over at front line. Here's Mike with his tiger. Ready to join the fight, soldier. Manage my enlistment. That's nice and close. That's a high intensity one. Goodbye. Confirmed. Get to the dropship, soldier. I'll call on the Imperial The smoothest taste. The richest aroma. It can only be any We I don't know, can't remember. Um we're going to Manage my enlistment. Summerland 4A. And we're doing the high in high intensity one and we're fighting for Summerland patrons. Confirmed. Get to the dropship, soldier. Let's go and find everybody else. Where is everybody else? Nobody else in there. Where's Simon gone? Where are you to, Simon? Grab your gun and do your duty. Aha. God knows where you are, though. Oh, here he is. 4A, and it's the, um... Uh, ooh, Tony! I know. <laughs> that really is a ridiculous looking helmet. Isn't it? <laughs> Change this light to do my editing. Oh. Ah. Right. To the shuttle, Batman. Yep, synthetics assembly, that's the stuff. Never remember the front or back. Just standardize on it for every ship. That's what I say. Standardize on it for every ship, and everything will be fine. Welcome aboard. Now, now we're gonna see. Now we're gonna see if the instancing works.
This will be interesting. I haven't tried this for the last two updates. So it's going to be interesting to see if it indeed does work. What do we think? Do we think it'll work? I don't know. I'm naturally suspicious. Cool, brilliant. Let's hope it does. All ah, right, well, hopefully, hopefully it'll be all right. I'm going in there with my pistol. Ah, right, yeah. Well, I had one just changing ships as soon as I started streaming today on the stream. Everything was fine. Just fell down. Fell through the floor. Is what it did. Do this right, we'll get millions. Because that's quite interesting, isn't it, right? That arm boy there. Moving part. Hazard. What exactly, you know? Because it certainly isn't the cockpit. Here we go. Yep. Here we go. I'm going in there, snipe it up. So far, so good. I don't know. It might be something to do with the hard points. You know? That would say it's a canopy thing. The whole thing lifts up. Then that's not the design of the ship, is it? I don't know. There it is there, look. Where will we be fighting today? Well, <clears throat> there, that's where we're going to be fighting. Nearing the drop zone. Get ready. Here we go. with his rocket launcher. 
Oh, critically injured. Take it out. It is really profitable. Here we go. We're keeping the same loadout. <laughs> Ships being lasered out of the sky. I wonder who that could be. <laughs> the drop zone. Get ready. Here we go. Come on, let's drop. Right. I'm right behind you. You haven't won yet. Here he is. He's round here somewhere. Shot a right in the buttocks. Who's this? He's one of ours. There they are behind him. Alpha is now online. Ah, Mike, sorry. Where is he? Gotta be inside. Things aren't going well. Bit of lag there. We're getting a bit of lag. I think I shot right the way through this guy. Too right they are. Let's go to the pistol. Tense. 
Ah. It's at that stage you think, hmm, I need something with a... We had them all cornered. Change loadout. Um, I'm going with a shotgun. The Dominator suit. Let's see. <clears throat> you never know. It might be a bit better. Unlikely. Yes, drop, drop, drop. There's someone there, right there. Take that. Yes, we're on the shotguns now, baby. Have it. Single-handedly capturing a base here. Check it out. They came in the back door. Who were misses? Sneaky monkeys. Right, that's secured. Lovely. This thing is useless. Better off with a flipping pistol. Baboom! Baboom! I played Doom in the in the eighties, baby. This is getting ridiculous. We'll keep the same loadout. They've only got 10 people left. Come on, come on, come on. We're going back in. Let's 
Still got my Dominator suit on. We're dropping. We've dropped. This guy down here looks like he's dead. Quite a bit of lag. He's ours. He isn't. Good grief. How many times you got to shoot these people? Reloading. Watch my back. Enemy force eliminated. That's a solid victory. We'll have your payment waiting. We've done him. We've done him. Good stuff, Simon. Simon shot the guys down. That was quite good fun. In fact, it was very good fun. Mixing it up a bit. That's the good thing about it, isn't it, really? They just didn't like it. Yeah, I saw him shooting. Oh, dear me. That was good stuff. So, the Summerland War. Not bad, really. Not bad at all. <laughs> okay, back to the hangar. Yes, sure I can. 
Let's have a look. Eh, eh. There you go. You are in the team. Faye is in solo play. Totally there, in the groups. I've just manually done it. Well, I'm going to do one more mission, and I'm going to call it a day. Or really, I'm going to call it a weekend, because um, i got stuff on tomorrow. Unfortunately. Well, unfortunately, fortunately, you know, life gets in the way, doesn't it? Huh? It's good stuff. 2 a.m.? It's been a good three hour, 40 minute stream, mind. The fight is never over, soldier. If you want to make a difference, this is where you start. I have combat bombs to resume. No problem. Look at that. Bum, bum, bum. So that's not bad, is it? That's a good earn, in fact. Dropship's waiting for you in the that's a damn good earn. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to knock it on the head, I think, today. That's going to be it for the stream. Thank you all for all of you who are joining. I'm going to be as my, the light that I've got here. It's, uh, that's a bit better. should be able to see me now a little bit better. Um, it has been a long one. Three hours, 40 minutes. Look at that. If you haven't already done so, hit that like and subscribe button and also that follow button. It's a small thing you can do, but it means a lot to me. It really does. And um, I've had fun. I've had real fun. I won't be streaming tomorrow. I've got other things to do, unfortunately. But there's videos coming out on Monday in regards to power play and the um, containment missile from Yuri Grom. That's coming out on Monday. And hopefully some videos as well. We might well get a good announcement from Frontier this week as well. I'll be worthwhile commenting on as well. Okay, so thanks very much everyone. Really enjoyed playing. Thanks to the new friends and the new followers and joiners of the group. That's been great. Thanks to Mike and Simon as always. We really have good fun and everybody else who has participated. See you later. Be safe. And if you're in the UK, don't get blown away. <laughs>